Can we get into the definition? Do we know what the meanings of these are? Go blonde, you want to start? Like lip bits. Is pizza a thing in England? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Oh, I didn't mean that. Yo, he's offended now. Yeah. What's up guys, it's the Donnellys, welcome to the video. So we're going to England pretty soon, so um, we're doing a lot of English stuff, a lot of English videos. One of these videos is guess the British phrases, all the Americans are going to try and guess the British phrases inspired yeah, by. Yeah, so this is, video is inspired by Joel and Leah, and we're super happy they sent us these phrases. We're going to be doing a collab with them when we go to England, so please make sure to go check out their channel. Um, I think it's just Joel and Leah, and also they filmed a video like this where they guessed American phrases yeah. And it was really funny because they just had no idea what they were <laughs> And like it's weird just like we know what they are, but they just don't And like also, they're guys, trying to guess them and it was just really funny that's, Anyway, That's insane, like it's insane Also, also guys, while we're in London, we're going to be having a meetup at 11am in Pottersfield Park on April 19th So come meet us there, uh, we want to meet you. you And uh, yeah so what's, let's what's this get field? right into the video. Let's get this video started with no. Do we know one. what the meanings of these are? I have yeah. the answers. Okay, okay. Mom yes. has the answers. Core blimey. C O R B. Core blimey. Core blimey. I feel like that's something a pirate. Core right. blimey! Yeah, it's right? Cor it's like an exclamation. Cor it's definitely an exclamation. Yeah. yeah. Like, someone's like. It's like a, oh my gosh! Core blimey, you want to start? Like, like an animal like runs out in the street. Like, Core blimey. Like you're driving and then what's an animal runs like, Core blimey! Yeah. Core blind, like that just is not a thing. That's just... Core blind. Like, at least the... Phrase. I mean, the American phrases that we watched in the video were actual words. That's just not a word. Core blind. I think they're like... If you looked it up in the Webster's I mean, Dictionary, they have would the same core language. or blindy come up? I don't know. No. no. Mom, do you have an answer for us? Yeah, yeah, core blimey is derived from the Middle Age expression, God blind me, used when someone saw something they shouldn't have. Commonly used in expressions by upper class Brits when in shock or surprise. Brits. Mainly, yeah. mainly as a form of really stupid exaggeration. <laughs> like, so, so if, I, if I walked in and saw your hair burning, I'd be like, core blimey! That's what I'm going to say. That's ugly. <laughs> that's ugly. <laughs> it's like a raccoon like puking out trash on the side of the road, you'd be like, core blimey! Oh, that's what I, I was thinking. That's not what I was thinking about. Alright, number two. You. We did a pretty good job on that one. I'd say it's pretty that's I'm so chuffed success. to bits. <laughs> like, full. I'm saying, yeah. Yeah, like I'm really full. Like I'm chuffed to bits, so I'm. Ugh. I just got wow, torn up by. You... I just got torn up by a meat grinder. I'm chuffed to bits. Oh, um, just... I'm chuffed to bits. I'm gonna say I'm like chuffed. so busy to the point of like. Chuffed. I'm yeah. chuffed to bits. Like or, I can't do it. I'm or chuffed or to bits. I'm tired, you know? I'm chuffed. Like if it's like late, it's the like. Chat. Hey, you want to No, I'm chuffed to bits. Be like yeah, or like, what? Like do you want to come over after school? Now I got so much homework. Yeah, I'm chuffed to bits. Like I. I can't. I'm too busy. I'm gonna say Can we get like, definition? chuffed as in like no. chat, like chat lips, and it looks like they're in little bits, like lip bits. Yeah, That's just not chuffed. an answer. Chuffed to bits. Can we get a definition, Mom? Yes, you may. Chuffed to bits. The British English expression chuffed to bits. To be chuffed is to be pleased with something. To be chuffed to bits is to be very pleased. He was chuffed to bits when she accepted his proposal. Chuffed. So we will, we will be chuffed to bits when we go to London. Wow. <laughs> I'm going to be chuffed to bits. Not, I, I don't right. think that's what it means. Interesting way just, to put it. No. Right, okay. I'm going to make that an American quick, phrase. And video I'm going to make the meaning of it. Um, can you um, take my pizza? Wait, it's the digits. Pizza's ready. Do they have pizza in England? I think they weigh what are they kilograms. Use? They're kilograms. That's kilos. 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 Kilograms in England and they use pounds for money. Also, meters, like, come on. Is pizza a thing in England? Because Okay, after right. that. Is pizza a thing next, in England? Next, uh, next expression. Uh, rubbish. Yeah, I know that. Rubbish. 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 Come that's on. Rubbish. That's, that's rubbish. rubbish. That's, that's rubbish. rubbish. That's rubbish. If like, you're, if that's you're running down the pitch, if you're Raheem Sterling running down the pitch, and Virgil van Dyke comes in with the high boot right in your- Yeah. Ah! That's rubbish, Starts up, and the ref only gives him the yellow. That's rubbish. That's rubbish. That's absolutely that's rubbish. rubbish. Come on. That's rubbish. Come on, bro. That's if it's- <laughs> If it's- I, th I, I mean, I don't have all these like soccer <laughs> soccer terms to go with it. If it's trash, if it's like yeah. not good, someone does not like it, it's rubbish. Rubbish. Mm. rubbish. You don't agree with someone? Oh, it's rubbish. I'm gonna start saying that. So I'm gonna be like, I kinda like that. All right, so I, here's yeah, your homework like that assignment. Thing. Rubbish. It's better than cold, blarney. You know? Go away. Or bloody. You could say bloody rubbish. If it's it's bloody bad, rubbish, Mike. If it's very rubbish. If it's, it's very rubbish. rubbish. <laughs> if. If it's blatant offside, it's called. It's bloody rubbish. I mean, come on. Now, where's the offside? It's, 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 it
Be able to defend it. Cool. All right, can we get a, can we get a real definition? Yeah. Yes, you guys are right. My base is it can be a noun, a verb, or an adjective. The noun is like waste material. <laughs> it's pretty much like everything. Yeah, yeah, everything is rubbish in, in England. Read it in Britain. Whoa, whoa, so, whoa, whoa. 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 whoa! I didn't mean that. Yo, you offended uh, that. English, English, beautiful. English. Yeah. English. Yeah. It's like, it means trash. Everything is trash. Everything in England is trash. That's what you just said. It's not. No. To, to, uh, as That's a verb, it's it. to criticize severely and reject as worthless. Yeah. Adjective is wow, very bad, worthless, or use, use, useless. That's rubbish. Right? It's, it's rubbish. rubbish. It's rubbish. The bees knees. Oh, we use this one in America all the time. The bees knees. That's the heck is that? that happy? That's the greatest thing. I've oh, ever seen in my it's life. the bees knees. It's like the greatest thing since sliced bread. Like in, in Manchester, like the best team is Man City. They are the bees yeah, knees of football. I mean, it's it, it's insane. It's football. like in an F actual soccer. in actual football, the Chargers are the bees knees. That's just not it because they don't win. No, the Patriots. Oh yeah, the it's, Patriots not, it's not like we're. But it's not. It's like, it's like kind of the best, but it's like also. It's just the best. That's it. That's all it is. No, let me think of another way to put it. It's, it's like awesome. The best thing. It's awesome. Yeah, it's you just really like the it. best. It's like, man, this friggin' plate is the Dude, best. Dude, I don't know, like, do people, like, actually use these the terms? Like, if you go to England yeah, and they'll right? be like, like, this knees. is the bee's knees. Yeah. I can't imagine, like, keeping a straight face and being like, dude, it's the bee's knees. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, I can't help but laugh at that. Like, that's bees, so weird. Bees, legs. Bees don't have knees, do don't they? Don't even bend, I don't think. I don't think do bees they? do have yeah. legs. They have so a little, have if they don't bend, like, then it's impossible for them to have knees because that's the joint where the yeah, leg Yeah, it's like bends. the oven's so arms. So if you really think, it's like they don't have arms, think about it, I mean, it doesn't really. It's just it's something that's not true. The oven's arms. That's the, that's the oven's arms. That's the oven's arms. That's what we're going to say. We're going to make that our next American phrase. All right. Are you guys these bees? You are correct. When bees flit from flower to flower, the nectar sticks to their legs. Nectar. <laughs> nectar. Sorry. Nectar sticks to their legs. The phrase bees knees means sweet and good because the knees of the bee are where all the sweet good stuff is collected. So they do have knees. So it is bees knees. Um, Bob's your uncle. <laughs> Bob's your uncle. Bob Duncan was the first thing that came to my head. Bob's your uncle. Um. Bob's your uncle. Uh. You're in a terrible situation. You hate this guy named Bob. And somehow you And he's that crazy uncle that shows about your family reunions and like... Yeah. He eats all the big beans. So. Yeah, he eats all the... Bob. Uncle Bob. I'm like, come on. Bob's your uncle. Yeah, it's all the... Bob's your uncle. Hold on. I feel like it's like... It's like... Oh, well, Bob's your uncle. Like, if something happens to you and you're like... Or like, you're related to someone. Like I kind of feel like it's like, it is what it is. Like, if something happens oh. and it's like... Yeah, that's, I can agree oh, with that. Like, gosh, oh, like, my Bob, car broke like, down. Oh, Bob's your uncle. Like, that yeah, sucks, but that's how it, it is. But like, yeah. But it's just... It happens. happened. Exactly. Yeah. It's there. But then you like, can't do anything about it. Your uncle. I mean, what do you yeah. like it's Bob's not? your uncle and you can't change you that. Can't change that. <laughs> I mean, uncle you can't change that. You can't disown Uncle Bob. He just eats your beans. Like, <laughs> you just can't, yeah, you can keep, <laughs> keep eating your beans. Guys, I just want to say I have a cold and my nose has been like going like it's not rocket it's been like yeah, it's <laughs> running That's and like it makes me feel like i have to sneeze and then my eyes start to water so i'm sorry if it looks like i'm crying I'm fun not fact crying. about myself when i'm at practice and i have a runny nose it's not rocket it's not ew rocket. that's disgusting <laughs> why do you want i so want to do that in the pool. when i get my expander out i'll be shooting crazy accurate loogies it's like i'm like a lot <laughs> Okay. Insane. It's really insane. Mom, can we get a definition for Bob's your uncle? Bob's your uncle. Yes, you can. You guys were not right on this one at all. Really? It's a. <clears throat> this is very interesting. It's a catchphrase dating back to 1887. Does it relate to someone named Bob, a historical yes. Bob figure? Yes. Really? Yeah, Robert. Robert. When, in a blatant case of favoritism, British Prime Minister Robert Cecil decided to appoint his nephew, Arthur Balfour, to the prestigious and sensitive post of Chief Secretary of Ireland. So Bob's your uncle is another way of saying your success is guaranteed. Oh. So you're pretty much, ah, Bob's yeah, your uncle, yeah. you're gonna I, get it. Like, I, right? I got the job promotion, well, Bob's your uncle. Mm -hmm. like, no, Brian, that's not it. Or like, like on, on a kid's like sports team, like, oh, yay, I'm quarterback. Well, Bob's your uncle, like your dad's a coach, so. Well, that's Same literally, thing. but, but some, sometimes, like for example, they gave this use example. The expression? You want to go to the stadium? Yeah. Go straight until you reach the park. Take the first and left. Bob's and Bob's your uncle. uncle. You're there. Yes. Oh, <laughs> and voila. Like, and voila. Like, and there you are. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like that makes morning. sense. All right. You just put the parts together like this, and Bob's your uncle. It works. Oh. Crazy, That's right? So I'm going to start using that one. I like that one. Yeah, I can always go. Bob's your uncle. Bog standard? 
I feel like, I think it's like I feel crappy. Like, exactly, like bog like, is yeah, something that's like bog bad. standards. Yeah, it's standard. like it's like you don't have high hopes. It's like you have a bog standard. Because the bog is like yeah the place where everything is. When I think of bog standard, I think of like a back alley, like a dark, crusty back alley <laughs> somewhere. Bog is. I just I just want to think about when I think about bog bog standard, like that's a crusty alley with like ugly drains. Like, you know where Mr. Peabody and Sherman, where they found Sherman? <laughs> like, there. Like, in that alley. And it's like, oh, or like the that one episode of, um... Oh! Let's go. I want an episode of the Mickey Mouse cartoons where he's, like, in England and they're running from the thing, the the dogs. You know what I'm talking about? And he goes in the back alley and then hides in the drain. I can't believe we still remember. I have <laughs> some education <laughs> to sprinkle on all you. Dang. For my environmental science. Listen up, kids. Bogs are places that are kind of like swamps, but they're decomposing. So the peat, the peat is like the, the, the precursor to like coal, how it's like, it's carbon, and it's packed into little peat things, and then eventually after compression and compression and compression of years and years, it turns into coal. So bog stuff is decomposing and like disgusting and it's gross. So the bog standard is like a bad standard. Can we Good. Okay. 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 Great. And mom I'm glad is a, that that's over. Mom, Bob's your uncle. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right. You guys want to know? Bob yes. Standard. Bob yes. Standard. You're pretty good. Bob it's standard. not as bad as you had said, but it's that it's an adjective. It's completely, utterly, absolutely ordinary in every way for British yeah. slang. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's like Bob it's like you're standard. average. Like you're just. Uh, you're not special. Yeah. And you're not special. Tot. You're bog like Dave standard. drives a total bog standard car. Like it's. <laughs> Totally bog standard. Whoa, no need to. Sorry, Dave. Get on Dave's case. Oh, I don't need to the example that was given. <laughs> chin wag. Chin wag? Chin. Chin wag. Chin wag. Chin wag. Chin wag. So, I mean, the obvious response, I feel like, chin would be. Chin wag? Chin wag? No. Like, wag your chin? Like, no. That's... I, feel like, I feel like it's like a um, an insult. Like, you chin wag. You chin ha. Like, get out of here! Get your chin wag! That's a good no. way to date someone. It would be like, I'd be offended if someone you chin wag! Yeah, you chin wag! Like, if you, like, if someone, if you were like, oh, can you hold my phone? And they say, yeah, and dropped your phone, and be like, you chin wag! <laughs> like, I've got two possible definitions for chin wag. One is like, nah, like, I'm just gonna give you a little chin wag. But I feel like that's too obvious. A chin wag, like a... So, a chin wag has to be like, when someone thinks they're above you, and they put their chin up, and they're like, got their head up, and they're like, mm. Like, they're like pathetic. Time. Like, I'm literally, like, physically, mentally, socially better than you in every aspect. So I'm like, like just you're, yeah. chin wag by just, You know what I'm saying? You're a chin wag so. for that. <laughs> <laughs> you're such a chin wag, bro. So Brennan's, Brennan's second example of chin wag would be, like, the opposite of bog standard, right? Like, the chin wag and a yeah. bog standard, right? Well, chin wag right. would think chin wag is, is like a lot better he'd than Bob. He'd think he's way above because his uncle's Bob. Bob is his uncle. <laughs> and <laughs> because because Bob is his uncle and he's rich, he thinks. Or then Corbin, I can he thinks, see. He, he thinks he's above the um, Bob standard. Even he thinks he's the bee's knees. He thinks he is the bee's knees. I mean, but he shouts <laughs> core blinding when he finds a rubbish piece of uh, Bob's your uncle person, in, in Bob's like your uncle. someone whose uncle is not named Bob. I mean, chip to bits. I, yeah, I'm well, he would be chip to bits. Also, I feel like it's like a bad situation, you know, like a chin wag. Like I've got a chin wag. Yeah, like, like a yeah, like, yeah, well, or like like a police. Ryan. Like I got a chin wag two, three, four. At a, <laughs> I got a chin wag on four. I hit the eighth and seventh on, on the bank. You've been diagnosed with chin wag. No, no, right, I'm sorry. It's gonna no, be tough. How long do I have? It's gonna be tough. How long do I have? Maybe a day. <laughs> it's, it's, it's uncurable, but it literally chin has wag. no effect on you. It just makes your chin wag. Bob's your It makes your chin wag. Final definition. All right, chin wag, you guys. It's to have a conversation or to talk to another person. Okay. So it's sort of like oh. shoot the breeze. Sort of like yeah. So Bernard and I, I don't know. We met for coffee and had a little chin wag. Had, had a chin wag. That sounds you like get, some. Chin let's have a chin wag. Well, because I, I guess if you're talking. Then Everyone in chin. England or wherever oh, true. say like, let's have a catch or let's have a talk. Let me have a think about it. Like have what? A, have a watch. Have a watch. Have a watch of Joel and Leah's video. Have a drink. American also, uh, I know something is like I invite you like to pay for something for someone is like I, I'll invite you to coffee, like I'll pay for your coffee. Well, Ryan watches like, for ideas. No, I no I right? don't. Uh, you got to do. Yeah. No, I don't. It's okay. No, I don't watch for ideas. No, I don't.
I watched like three or four Fortnite videos. Everyone watches Katie, Fortnite videos. Katie. Yeah. It's not I watched two or three Fortnite videos. It's not yeah. something to be ashamed of. It's not. It's not like Ryan spent five hours on the Xbox making a huge super big no, slice of it on Fortnite. No, I didn't. It did I... not happen. That never happened. I don't even know. Ryan doesn't even know what Fortnite is. It suggests no. that he did that yesterday. He does not think it's the bee's knees. So one more time, guys. Thank you so much for Should watching. We're, we're going to England very soon. Uh, hopefully, we can meet you guys there. Stay tuned. Please come. Yes, we want to see you. 11 a.m. Parker's. Potter's we've never. Potter's Field. Park. We've never had an uh, outside of this country meetup, so this That's is going to be basketball. exciting. Basketball. I'm excited That's about it. Setting records. We're going abroad. Thank hey, you hey. for joining me one more time for the video suggestion. Like, be sure to share. comment below. If you guys are from England and you actually know what these mean, and you want to give us some examples do. because yeah, that's true. we're struggling. Or like what you use, what cold your phrases, or whatever, like, like these phrases. Yeah. So please be sure to do that. Share this video with your friends if you think they'll like it. Friends, family, we love friends, and family, and yeah. like, subscribe, and uh, see you in the next video. This is gonna be our thing to salute, by the way. If you ever see me do a salute. I don't that's think gonna that's gonna be, be our thing. That's gonna be no, that's gonna be my thing. That you do. That's gonna be your thing. Let us know if you're coming to meet up. Comment down below. Whatever you want to say. Let your mind go about terminology, ooh. England, America, ooh. whatever. Yo, that's not deep. Thanks, guys. Hey, ooh, ooh, yo, hey. Oh, hey. subscribe. Hey. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.